Hi and welcome again to uh, Tony's Kind Thoughts video number five here. I'm actually shooting this um, video from uh, Santa Cruz, uh, an incredible place, some of the most amazing um, designer, uh, designer shops I've seen anywhere, uh, even with violinists uh, welcoming you into the buildings as you shop. And behind me I have this huge um, theatre, a bit like the uh, Sydney, um, Sydney Opera House in Australia. Um, so join me on today's video and we'll be looking at uh, uh, some more uh, Thomas uh, Troward's facts, so uh, I'll, I'll see you in a little bit. Hi and welcome again to uh, Tony's Kind Thoughts. Um, where are we now? Video 5? and uh, from uh, Santa Cruz. Um, in today's video I want to talk a little bit about uh, Thomas Troard's idea of the subjective um, spirit that permeates all time and space. It's something really that you can only grasp with your uh, feelings uh, rather than knowledge. So it's something we have to kind of feel um, through our uh, intuition and uh, it's the idea of that subjective force. You'll never be able to find it uh, by uh, knowledge alone. It's something we have to feel through intuition. It's something deep inside that we can connect with. And we sense somehow that this power, this creative power that's within us is also within everything else, including nature and these um, beautiful surroundings you see around me now. This power that is in, in every creature and every living thing is also impersonal in the sense that it doesn't choose the, the particular person to work through or with. It's just an energy, it's just a force. Um, and I guess you could say you could be asking for big things or small things, but this power would still uh, work for you. It's an impersonal power. But this power only responds as we grow to recognize it. So the more that you uh, recognize this power, the more that it can work through you. So being aware of it on a daily basis is, is actually very powerful. Um, Thomas Troard says that um, this power, and I'll quote for you, Thomas Troard says, by law, it must be ready to respond to all those who realize it. So in other words, the more that you become aware of this immense power, this creative power across the whole universe, the more it can work for you. So in today's video, I want you to try and think about um, building um, that new image for your dream, for your future. That new image in your mind, which is also resonating with uh, subjective intelligence. So I'll leave you with that thought today. So next time I see you, try and think about that new image, that new um, thought, that new future that you want to create. When I first started to want to do these uh, videos, believe you me, there was a lot of... Uh, and nerves uh, standing with the video camera and doing this in public but uh, I heard some great wisdom recently say that in order to create your dreams you've got to step out you've got to actually be um, that person that you wish to be and to share and to grow through uh, providing a, an amazing service so until I see you next time on uh, Tones Kind Thoughts uh, you have a great week you infinite spiritual being